Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix a D3D 9.dll not found or missing error. So, without further ado, let's get started. So, the first solution for you is to try to restart, just restart your computer, and so uh, for some people, it fix the problem. So, just simply restart your computer and look if the problem persists or not. And if the problem persists, uh, the next thing that I suggest you to do here is to install the latest version of Microsoft DirectX. And to do so, open a browser and then you just need to write on Google uh, DirectX uh, and user runtime. And probably it will be the, the first link here, DirectX and user runtime web installer. Just press on the link, then download a, a here. And once you download it, you should get this setup, press on that. And then you just need to uh, select I accept agreement, uh, just deselect this and install. And then you need to look if the problem persists or not after you uh, restart your computer. And if the problem is uh, persisting, then you just need to open up CMD or command prompt, uh, right click on it, run as administrator. And on here, you just need to write a uh, CFC. Uh, forward slash scan now one word and then wait until it completes so uh, basically what it does uh, this scan will find sub uh, it will find some corrupted files and uh, the and computer itself will fix it for you uh, after verification is complete and after you restart your computer right and if it's not the case, if it's still not working, what I suggest to do here first is to probably you get this error when you try to uh, open up some game. So you just need to go, for example, on Steam, find the game, right click on it, go to library, uh, properties, uh, install files and verify integrity of, uh, of the game files. So maybe your file is game file is corrupted. And then what you need to do here next is to press browse on this window, then find exe file right click on it and uh, go to properties compatibility and make sure to uh, disable this option here run this program uh, in compatibility mode 4 make sure to disable this and this and then look you need to look if the problem persists or not if the problem persists simply just reinstall the game and look uh, if it's persisting or not and the last thing that is suggested to do here is to update your gpu drivers so for me i'm using nvidia uh, gpu so there is geforce experience app where i can go and i can go to drivers check for updates and if there is a driver that i need to download and install it i can do it easily here if using kmd i believe there is emd radiant app to that or simply try to just go to device manager and then here expand display adapters right click on it on your gpu and update driver here by searching automatically for drivers right so yeah that's pretty much it and if i help you out please press like button and subscribe for more take care bye